Today, scientists led by Stephen Hawking are using high-tech scanners to discover if a huge, cigar-shaped comet is in fact an alien probe. Now, one astronomer claims that the space rock, named Aumuamua, could be an alien spacecraft with broken engines that is tumbling through our solar system. Dr. Jason Wright from Penn State University suggests that a broken alien spacecraft move in exactly the same way as the interstellar comet. A cigar-shaped comet named Aumuamua sailed past Earth last month and is the first interstellar object seen in the solar system. It was first spotted by a telescope in Hawaii on 18 October and was observed 34 separate times in the following week. Traveling at 44 km per second, 27 miles per second, the comet is headed away from the Earth and Sun on its way out of the solar system. The comet is up to one quarter mile, 400 meters, long and highly elongated perhaps 10 times, as long as it is wide. Rather than moving through space like other space rocks, astronomers believe that it is tumbling through our solar system. In fact, since they, presumably, no longer have attitude control, one would expect that they would eventually begin to tumble, and if they are very rigid, that tumbling might distinguish them from ordinary interstellar asteroids, and in fact, just because their propulsion is broken doesn't mean that their radio transmitters would be broken. Apostrophe. Dr. Wright suggests that the object could be a von Neumann probe theoretical self-replicating spacecraft that visits star systems. He added, such a discovery would imply that there are lots of these things in the solar system at any given moment, even if they are deliberately targeting the sun, they are hard to spot and we'll miss most of them, and so lots of opportunities to study them. Apostrophe. Dr. Wright previously suggested the mysterious dimming of star kick 8462852, also known as Tabby's star, could be caused by an alien megastructure called a Dyson Sphere. His latest comments come ahead of a project later today in which scientists will use high-tech scanners to discover if Aumuamua was sent by an alien civilization. The team of scientists, called Breakthrough Listen, will use the world's largest directable radio telescope at Green Bank in West Virginia to follow it for 10 hours today at 3 p.m. at 8 p.m. GMT.
Yomi Amiura is a Hawaiian term meaning a messenger from afar arriving first. Dot most intriguingly, it is the wrong shape for an asteroid, they are typically round. Apostrophe. Another oddity is that Amuamura is flying very cleanly, without emitting the usual cloud of space dust that astronomers observe around asteroids. Experts say this suggests it is made of something dense. Probably rock, but possibly metal. It was first detected on October 19 by a long-running research program called PAN-STARRS, which uses powerful telescopes to photograph and monitor the night sky at the University of Hawaii. Its amazing speed has led some experts to conclude it is the first such object to have come towards us from outside our solar system. Analysts also say its faintly red color indicates it has been subjected to interstellar cosmic radiation which is harsher than we experience in our solar system. The fact that it doesn't seem to have engines or show signs of propulsion may wreck the interplanetary spacecraft theory. If a radio signal does come back from the object, Professor Ravi Loeb, Professor of Astronomy at Harvard University, suggests that we will need to proceed with caution. Speaking to Mail Online, he said, My recommendation, as in any dialogue, is that we first listen and do our best to understand what we are hearing. I believe that a very intelligent civilization will be peaceful, and we could save ourselves millions or billions of years by learning from it. But there is also the possibility that such a civilization will have hostile intentions and risk our existence, so we should deliberate carefully in any future contact with them.